Hello guys, Igor here doing one more app summer review today analyzing Breeze, a tool that claims to stay on track with an easy to use project management tool. So it's a PM tool. The user interface is pretty cool. It's an alternative to Pluto, Trello, Basecamp, and Monday.com. So it's a project management tool that lets you organize, plan, and track the progress on your projects and tasks. One will get all the features of different kind of plans depending on the tier. So this is an important information here. If you buy the tier one, you get the freelancer. If you buy a uh, plan, if you buy the tier two, you got the small business. And if you buy the tier three, you get the large team plan updates. And the difference by now, um, are the number of active users per account. If you buy one code 10, if you buy tier two, 25, if you buy tier three, 50 active users per account. It's important to say that you don't need to add your client as users, your clients or any guests that you want to invite to your project, you will have that feature and it will be unlimited. So you can invite unlimited uh, people to your project. They will not be able to, you know, change um, aspects of the project, but they can see everything. I'm going to show you now how the tool works. As you can see here, we have that interface and the tool is divided by tasks, projects, calendar, reports, and activity. The first thing you're going to do is to create a new project. And you can uh, see the projects on your roadmap. Okay? So you can go to projects and go to roadmap. And here you can create a new project. Let's say you're going to create a to-do project, a doing project, or done project. So let's say you want to start a project right now. So you're going to create a doing project. And say here, the project is testing Breeze. And then you add the project. After you add the project, you can add a new description for it. Okay. Description here. You can also invite people to the project, guests or users. You can add a due date, a start date, an end date. You can archive it in the future, co-op or delete it. You can change the color of your project and the status, okay? And you can go back to projects you can select it and then you can add new tasks. So you can see how it's pretty uh, easy to use Breeze. You're going to click here, testing the tool. Created the project to do by the deal on AppSumo. Okay, so created two different uh, tasks here and it's pretty easy to change the location. Just drag and drop. Okay. And here, when you click on the task, you can see the features. You can add descriptions. Okay. You can use a, the time tracking features to log work or start the timer. The timer works like that. You can click here to stop the timer. Okay, and it will track that timer. Okay, so someone worked, you know, uh, for one hour in that project, etc. You can create to do list, test into tool, create an account, and invite users, etc. And you have here uh, the 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 to do list. Okay, you can click here. And you can also assign people to the list. 
the, each task has a discussion feature where people can, you know, post things here. So if you here on um, below, you can change status, you can change color, you can change the tags and create tags to organize uh, your tasks. You can add files from your computer, Google Drive, Dropbox, Box, OneDrive, and Evernote. Those are the integrations. You can assign the product to someone, add start date and end date. Um, <clears throat> how long are going to work? Doing an estimate here. Subscribing users and more. Repeat task, email for task, create a public link for that task. This is possible as well. Okay. So people will not be in need to log in to see it. You can click create notes on your projects. Clicking here, you're going to see the notes related to that project. You can add files on the project. Instead of doing inside the tasks, you can create here and add on the, the project. Have a board, see as a list, as a board, as a dashboard. The dashboard will, you know, you, you're going to see the analytics and the activity as well. You can show up. Okay. It's pretty simple to create uh, a project and manage the tasks here. So it's easy to, you know, uh, make your users, your employees understand and your, your uh, partners to understand how to use it. You have also a tab to see all the tasks. They have a calendar. You can see the calendar here. A report. And you can see all the activities. There is a search feature if you want to search any keywords. You can add tasks and track time um, using the plus button here. And that's breeze. Pretty easy. If you want to invite people, you go here. Click here on add people and just do it. Or you can share an opt-in link as well. So, um, I like that kind of tool. I think it's a easy to use project management. If you don't need, you know, all the whistles and bells and you need a bread to go project management to, you know, add people in and just start to work. I think Breeze, uh, has, um, a good um, interface for that. I think the user interface and the user experience are the main features for a project management tool because you need to be able to work using it. If it's really hard to work using it, so it's not a good project management tool. That's Breeze. Uh, the price is good on AppSumo. If you like my review, please click on the link below. Just click on it and you will help me a lot. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.